so we could try it. One heck of a time. I keep on thinking it's gonna say a lifetime. It's been a lifetime of boss battles. You can link Zebra Bonus if you want. Well, well, well. Look at how far you've come. Not only did you just, you bust up my good for nothing lackey, King Dice. But I see you've got my soul contracts as agreed. Hand them over and join my team, whoa. Hmm. Can I? What happens if I say yes? I mean, I don't want to. Cause, don't deal with the devil, it's in the game's name. <laughs> Eat him up, or okay, I'm just gonna say no. Welching on, on me just like all the others, eh? I'll teach you for backing out of a deal, I'm at you. All right, well. Let's see what we can do here. What is this guy gonna be? I mean, difficult is the obvious answer. Oh wow, Kappa's like, oh boy. He honestly has some weird dimensions. He's a little skinny. Okay, well he does that. I'm gonna have to try to figure out like what he does before I start changing up what weapons I'm using. Oh wow, oh my. Okay, so he does some fancy things. He's got his little goons walking around. Wow, the background for this is just fantastic. I'm gonna try a couple times before we get into anything. You broke our deal. Now it's my turn to break it. What do you mean, our deal? I thought our deal was to get all the contracts because that's what I did, so you're a liar. But hey, that's not too surprising. Okay, so this is different. Oh wow, he's a dragon. That's, oh I see him supposed to be under his like little wave. I'm sure this guy has like 80,000 health as well in like 13 different phases. But that's actually pretty easy just to look up like that. Okay, get the parry, not bad. Ooh. So yeah, once again, if you guys, you know, see that I'm doing bad these first couple rounds, feel free to suggest weapons you might use for this boss, but at the same time, I'm just taste testing things a little bit. So I want to stay out of the way. I need to stay to either the left or the right when he spawns in the blue. Or like whenever he puts his little trident to the side. I guess it is a trident, ain't it? Okay, so go under, oh, that moves quicker than I thought it would. Okay, I'm learning a couple things already. What is he doing with his eyes? Oh, he's breaking a cup. Now I get it, that, that's awful. <laughs> All right. This ain't too bad. Then I gotta move to the side. The, de the little demon's coming on over this way. All right, we got little bubble bobble things bouncing around here. Honestly, not too bad. I don't think I can damage them, so I just gotta avoid them. Oh, okay. Gonna dodge that and the little demon. That ain't working. Man, I love how the lava's flowing in that volcano in the background. Hard not to notice all these beautiful details. Okay, you are maximum creepy right now, dude. And I think you know it. You're owning up to it. That was on me. And that, that phase lasts a little while, doesn't it? Lasts a good couple seconds. All right, dodge that. Get rid of the devil, dude. What you gonna do this time, huh? I mean, I could hit you with the milk now, I think. I don't, that does not seem like it's really hitting you. And I'm dead. <laughs> Use the weapon that allowed to damage him. Hey, we got past the first phase there. Anyone who opposes me will be destroyed. Retry. Okay. I think I want to shift to the auto aim when he starts that. See, so, you know, once again, if I could get past the first phase, just so we could taste test what's after that, that's all I want. And then maybe we can reconsider what weapons we want to use. Wow, I'm awful. <laughs> I am awful. No, I shouldn't be taking damage here. It's super easy. All right, so now he's the spider. Can you even damage him when he's in this phase? It looks like you can, which is pretty cool. And this really isn't that bad to dodge. It's just about paying a, a minute amount of attention to where he's coming down from. And then it's back to this. Ooh, ooh, that was as close as it gets without dying. All right, he's back to his old incantations. Okay, yeah, well definitely, now that I've seen, he moves pretty gosh darn quick. Let's try this again but with something else. What would I wouldn't, What would I rather do differently here, though? Like, that's sort of the thing, I like the combo. But I feel like other people won't appreciate it. So maybe I could do the the roundabout? I don't know, we'll see, let's try something like that. I don't think I'm gonna prefer the extra HP. Also, I went against every boss, yeah, I definitely did, on that. Oh, they all have their own little names, too. That's cute. Yeah. 
Oh man, oh man. We got it. Oh wow, do you have to do this every time? I mean, I guess every time you re-enter the boss fight. Which is fine. Okay, so now we're starting with this. Like, th I think this right here does more damage, technically. Oh, what, I didn't parry that? Okay, I find that to be a tad arguable, but oh, no, the moment's over, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just gotta remember, when that trident goes to its side, I gotta start booking it. All right, it's just the auto aim helps so much for situations where I wanna be doing damage to him anyways. I mean, maybe you'd be able to make up for that quickly enough, but I don't know. For me, it works, so I'm not gonna complain. All right. Let's see how, if we can get into that second phase. We've only been able to sort of like slightly touch the second phase. All right, well, trying to get the parry. There we go, there's that parry. If I can get to the second phase without using, oh, I think this is the second phase, no it's not. Oh, that is so, whoa, whoa, hold on. What? How can I dodge that? Oh, I think this is the second phase. He's like showing his teeth. Oh, and he's, go. Oh, where are we going? Anyone who opposes me will be destroyed. Weird. That is really weird. I don't really like the dragon one too much. Bit of a drag if you ask me. Okay, so I just hide in the corner. If you hide in the corner, you might get hit by the little demon, so you gotta pay attention about that. That ain't too bad of a deal. Okay, so he's doing his, ow. It is a really high class bout. If there were no other bouts. I can't hit take damage right away though. I mean, maybe I should just deal with it. All right, so it's the little bubble bobbles. Got it! Now oh, the demon! It's always the demon's fault. I mean, luckily with the roundabout, if I do miss, I do have a slight chance of it coming back and hitting him, which is a nice thing to have. All right, so there's not a demon coming around this side just yet. Yep, he was coming around the right, so I was fine there. He's popping around the left. I hit him in one hit though, and that's that's just fine. That's nice. All right, we have the super. Ow, oh, I cannot believe I took damage. That's just embarrassing. All right, so I need to just, like stay on the side here. He's gonna go, and I, oh wow, well, I don't have a choice. He just hopped out of his own skin. Oh hey, you're huge! Oh, I can't attack. Oh no, no I can. Oh, it was just not working for a moment. Uh, that is really <laughs> weird. He's very glowy. Man, that phase doesn't seem to be very long though. I like hit him once, and it was already like a third through it. So if I could just get better at dodging this, which I feel like is surely possible. I'm just gonna do the auto aim for this. I really don't think it's necessary to do too much more. There we go, go back like this. He's about to, do that, sure, why not? So far I haven't taken any damage, which is fantastic. Okay. Oh, he's doing his oobula loobula. Oh. There we go, ooh, ooh, look at me. Look at me, okay. It's like seven different kinds of awful. Uh. Okay, so you can do damage to him when he's like that as well. That really ain't too bad. All right, so I think he's about, yep. About to do that now. He can take. He can do damage here, so I just gotta be careful. Going into this bad boy with full health. Man, is this cool artwork or what? I love it. I almost just fell. <laughs> now does this do damage? It does. Okay, no taken. I mean, it's sort of hard to tell what does do damage here and what doesn't. But okay, he's winking. He's winking and blinking, and my confidence is shrinking. I don't know what I was exactly supposed to, oh, is that like supposed to be a hint on where he's attacking? It's very, very hard to tell. Um, all right, if I parry that, it doesn't explode. Oh, oh gosh, he's got a sneeze, run! Oh, he's mad now. Oh, is this phase three? It is in phase three. All right, well, that's not parryable, that's orange, not pink. It is so hard to tell what's going on right now. There's just so much, wow, he has some really fluid animation. Yeah, we, wow, there's no way that's it. They're gonna pull like a Mario, where you beat them and you're like, oh yeah, I win, yay, oh no, that was just phase one. Cause there's no way that's it. There is no way. 
I will not buy that. I, I do not believe that that's it. I mean, obviously, if you know if it's it or not, don't spoil it. <laughs> but I don't buy it. There is definitely gonna be more. Or that last tiny phase is gonna be the most ridiculous set of damaging things I've ever seen. Jeez Louise down. It is tough. Like, it is really, really tough, but... Oh, no. Oh, we'll see. It was a good day for a swell battle, but this is not swell. Oh, okay, okay. Oh man, I missed that parry, which is sort of embarrassing. That's how I didn't miss it though. I definitely like using that super on round two. That was embarrassing. <laughs> okay, okay, get rid of the devil, the demon. Oh man, I don't know why I'm taking damage to this stuff. It's just not necessary. Oh boy. Oh boy. I really like his animation though. Like I've been just sort of looking at it. Of course I'm trying to focus so that, you know, I don't get damage taken. But I gotta say, he might be one of the most, and, and rightfully so, one of the most well animated enemies so far. He just, he has a really fluid movement to him. I really like it. The way he moves, he's very lanky, but he just moves so smoothly. It's, it's sort of a wonder to watch. All right. Oh my. Got that parry. Just barely. All right, I do not need to, yeah. Use the super on round one. It's just unnecessary. This time I didn't, like last time I got here, I did it without taking any damage. Not so much this time. I always feel like I'm gonna fall there. All right, I don't know if I can take damage from this when I do it like that. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I wanna keep with this. All right, well, I missed a parry there, but it's not really the end of the world. All right, so this is gonna start spinning. Just like my head. Oh, gosh. All right, so that's starting to spin again. Not too bad, to be honest. Okay, you come out of his ear, which is weird, but, oh, he, he's, he's sneezing. Watch out, he's like, I got something in my nose. Everybody watch out. I'm all so sick. We are, whoa, that was unnecessary damage. Like the utter definition of unnecessary damage. I'm so close to it though. Up, up. Hit him, hit him good. That does damage, that's all I wanted. No, I landed on the skull though, how close was that? Yeesh, he was about to move to his next phase. What is the next phase? I'm really curious now. That ain't too bad though, like I can manage that. And begin. I really like, I don't know if I'll ever be a voice actor because I don't have a good voice. But if I ever wanted, like if I ever was to be a voice actor, I would totally want to be the guy, like the, the, the opening announcer guy, and begin. Cause that just sounds like so much fun to do. It's just like, you know, you only got a couple of lines. You don't have to be like a long-term character. You can just say a couple of, and begin, there's gonna be a rough battle. You know, that kind of stuff. Like, that just sounds like a lot of fun. I'm going well, thank you. I mean, I feel like we're just reaching the beginning. I think it's totally a trick and that there's more, like there's gonna be like a second boss or something. There's no way this is just it, you know? I really, really don't think so. You can't fool me my years of video game playing and dying over and over. It's taught me well. I have a decent voice for voice acting, well, I appreciate it. I'm definitely not a good actor though. Whoa. All right, so do that. Oh man, it's so tough. Once again, it has that foreground thing where you can't just, you, you can't see what's in that corner. So you just better hope there ain't anything. Where did that dude? I mean, I guess then, you know, the situation just don't go in the corner. That's easier said than none as well. Oh my. Let's get into the auto aim. I can't believe I got hit there. And I really can't go into the second phase with one HP. I would've tried it. I really should have been. It's not advised. Okay. Well, that was silly of me. I definitely jumped that too early. I know I can do this without taking damage. It was just a matter of doing it. Oh, he's clapping. I knew you were over there. Oh, I can't do that. That was just unlucky. Sometimes a demon comes in from the right, which is really what you want if he's gonna do the dragon. 
I feel like I pressed jump there, but the game disagrees. Whoa, okay. Oh wow, I didn't even see the one that was on top of me. Man, I can't catch a break with not taking no damage with this. If there's no breaks needed, just play well, Zebra. It's just all you need to do. It'd be nice if he created more of a shadow, but he really doesn't. Not until it's too close to matter. I guess I don't have to do auto-aiming there. Whoa, okay. Oh man, I couldn't get out of there soon enough. It's always just the luck at the draw with those. Not really a big fan of it. I was able to do this just fine before and I sort of lost my mojo somewhere along the way. That's fine, just gotta get it back. Zebra's new groove. I shoot over here. Oh boy, see that's not too bad, that really isn't difficult. It's just about keeping aware, keeping focused, and dodging fireballs. I press the jump button game. I, oh man. I'm glad that he has some really cool animations and a cool environment, because I have a feeling we're gonna be here for a while. That was another thing about the uh, King Dice, it was just sort of really getting wearing. Oh. Oh. Got it. Hey, okay. All right, he's doing his evil incantations again. Oh, okay, I dodged it. So far, so good. Hey, okay. That's easy, as long as I don't run into the demon, which I did. Man, I was about to get out of this pretty much, God, whoa, he wouldn't, that, he's never done that before. <laughs> he has never done that before. Coming in from the left now. Really shaking it up on me when I thought I finally had got it done down pat. I definitely wanna get through this first phase without taking damage. I think that's just sort of the promised land right there. Maybe I should try a different shot to help me out with this first phase. I feel like I'm starting to not need the auto aim. Um, we'll have to see. Maybe I could use the charge shot instead of the auto aim for this. All right, dodge that. Get rid of that dude just because I don't like him. All right, so what is he gonna do next? He's gonna do his evil. I don't get this one much, so it's it's definitely hard to, I jumped, gang, come on. I feel like the parries are doing me dirty right now. I think now I'm gonna switch to the charge shot. If we die this time, or if I mess up so badly that there's no way I'm gonna survive the next couple phases. All right, we're, okay, you're coming in this way now. Oh man, I just should have moved over more. If I take one more damage, we'll definitely go back. So I do not like the idea of going into phase two with one health. That just is not gonna work. Especially since I've completed this wall. You know, not having a problem with it, you know? I don't know why I'm having such a problem now. All right. Nope. Oh boy. A great plan. I really hope it's a good slam. All right, move it. Ah, oh, man. I don't know what it is with me not getting the parries. I feel like I'm back to day one when I was messing up the parries before. It's just hard to hold the, the shoot button and press the parry button. All right, for this, I think I need a quicker shot and not to be awful at the game. It is crazy difficult. I love the art for this area, though I can't get over how cool the volcanoes look. Like, that is not an easy effect to pull off. I cannot imagine that was a short job to do that lava animation. That looks so gosh darn cool. All right, it seems like if you dodge, it actually... Oh boy. Wow, that was 100% luck. And then some. <laughs> Like this great bout. All right, coming in from the left. If I just hide right here and hit this dude, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. That's the ticket. All right, no, you little demon. I feel like I just got lucky that one time I survived this now. Like before I was thinking like, hey, I got it down, I'm figuring this out, and like, no, I'm just awful. Whoop. There we go, there we go. Dodge that, please, thank you. 
All right, at least I got through with two HP. It's better than one. And that's for gosh darn sure. I mean, for this last time, this just worked just fine. Are you gonna be moving to the left or the right? Oh, well, that was really unnecessary. That was just me being awkward. I was like, I was, I feel like I've, I've lost it a bit. Oh, I man. Thank you for the good luck wishes. I appreciate it. I'm really gonna need it. <laughs> oh boy. I dump over you. Okay, I'm just gonna hide over on the left. I got rid of the demon, which is everything I could have ever wanted. Gotcha. I don't know. Maybe I should stick with the roundabout. Maybe I'm asking too much if I'm just trying to also bring in the charge shot to this mess. Because I got through it just as fast as if I was just using the roundabout here. Oh man. Oh man. These things, like, like I know the answers just get better at dodging that, but uh, it's, it's very difficult. There we go, that was decent. Welcome to the stream, I hope you enjoy it. Oh boy. Okay, I got that, got him. Whoa, okay. Too close for comfort, sir. I think that was his last one. No, this is definitely his last one then. I'm glad you could still do damage to him when he's like that, because it would just be super difficult if he couldn't. Oh. All right, all right, all right. Oh man, I just can't get it now. I'm gonna, oh. Oh man, oh man. And he's still not done. I feel like he has more health this time or something. All right, well, I, I made it out of here, but it doesn't matter if I only have one HP. I was, I, I guess I was just getting some beginner's luck before. I was certainly doing better before. All right, well. That thing moves around really weirdly. I'm gonna hit him with the super now. Because I could have earned up more of a super before. I sort of was being silly. But I need to make my way over to the right, I think. Oh, easier said than done. <laughs> It's, it's weird how these second and third phases go by so quickly. It's really making me curious about what phase four is. I also don't like how he shoots his shot if you try to dodge that, so I think it's just better to keep it the roundabout. I mean, at this point, I really don't even know if I wanna hit this parry. I think I just wanna focus more on dodging. Like, maybe that's my mistake. Oh, that was just silly. That was just maximum silliness right there. Coming in, coming in, coming in. Don't worry, I got it, I got it, yeah. That was too soon. Oh, that was, that was ridiculous. All right, that time wasn't too bad. I really think maybe that's, that's the problem I'm having here is I'm trying so hard to get those parries, but I get the, I get the full charge anyways. So I might as well just never mind it. Hit you with this right away. That way, when you, I, I, uh, you know, we're gonna keep going. Tempted to retry, but there's no need to just yet. There we go, I got that parry. That's gonna be helpful. Helpful down the line. Okay, so you got the, the ax coming out here. Oh, he's sneezing. Man, I'm definitely getting hit on things I did not get hit on before. And that means I just need to take in the moment. Take it in, beat this dude up, make him regret he ever messed with a, with a cuphead like cuphead. I'm gonna retry. <laughs> the bubbles are the worst because they just sort of move in random directions right off the bat. Well, it seems like other ones sort of have a bit of a pattern to them. The bubbles eventually settle into a pattern, but the beginning of them is just patternless. All right, so hide in this corner and just shoot away. There is a demon about to pop up over there, but I got him just because random belt, it can be really awesome sometimes. Hopefully he turns into the goat. The goat's pretty easy to dodge as long as I pay attention. All right, I'm gonna move to the left. There we go, there we go, there we go. Get the demon. He's a spider now, which once again isn't too difficult. It could be easier, but honestly, it seems to be a lot smarter just to focus on surviving against a spider more than landing any kind of successful amount of hits. I think he's about, yep. Look at that, we got through phase one with no damage taken. 
Can you duck his feet smack? Uh, what, what part of his feet smack? I'm not really sure. Ow, well I wasn't fast enough for that one. Should have just supered. I definitely feel like a pressure to get over there and get rid of that bomb. But maybe I'm putting my energy in the wrong spot there. Cause look at how quickly we can get through that phase if we just avoid it. All right, well he's mad. I still have two HP though. These guys aren't too bad to dodge. As long as I just pay attention and parry some of them sometimes, but also don't mess up like that. Down to one HP, but I got that. And I can super, might as well. Okay, so that phase is done. Whatever happens next, I have no clue. Oh no, maybe the phase isn't done. Oh no, now it's definitely done, right? Oh, he's crying. What you crying about? You, you, you put me through this much? You put me through this much? I should be the one crying. I know I'm supposed to be parrying these tears, but gosh darn, it's no. Oh man. Oh. You used to be able to hide under the goat slap. Oh, interesting, you can't anymore. These, well, I'm doing okay just dodging them normally, so I'll leave it be for now. So he starts balling. That can't be it. He's, you know, you're gonna beat him like, haha, just kidding. But I think the idea is that you're supposed to hit the tears, but I feel like it's just too much of a risk for me having one HP, you know? All right, move over here. The demon's about to come on over. Darn. <sighs> well, I can't believe I missed that. That was awkward. I think I need to change this to the roundabouts at the beginning, but I'm not sure. Cause it's just like, at this point, I don't even see the need to use the charge more than maybe I can get like an extra hit in if I do it correctly. Whoop. Oh. I can't believe I'm getting hit by that. It's just definitely I need to learn them all or just get lucky enough to get the ones I'm lucky, like I, I just can get lucky against. I don't know. I think I need to get more tea. I ran out of tea like a half an hour ago. The tea helps, the, the tea is what gets me going. All right, it's going into the right, so I need to get rid of this guy, but you can't stink and see him. Yeah, I'm sort of getting sick of the charge. I think the charge shot's not helping me. In some situations, it's certainly helpful, and this one, it's just not for me. What are you gonna throw at me now? All right, focus on dodging. Don't focus on parrying, focus on dodging. There we go. And see, I get through it with damage taken from the unnecessary thing, but from the thing that was actually scary that I thought I was actually gonna take damage from no damage taken. As long as I hide here, he's gonna zoop on back. Man, why am I messing that up all of a sudden? My day's doing good, how, is you, how are you doing? All right, hold on. I'm gonna go ahead and exit to the map and change to the roundabout first. I think that'd be better. I think that'd be better than what I have because I'm like trying to get like a shot in with the charge shot and I feel like it's just making me focus on too much at once. So let me equip. Yep, just like that. Should be good. Red might be helpful. Maybe, yeah. I'm gonna just try right, right, real quick with just a roundabout and first slot, but yeah, we could try spread. The thing about spread is that I feel like this pressure to pay extra attention to my positioning when shooting, when I really just need to worry about my positioning when he's attacking. While with the roundabout, it's sort of easier to hit things even if I'm not exactly trying to be incredibly precise, just because you gotta be so close with the spread shot, you know? It's not a bad weapon at all, I'm just not very great with it. All right, jump over that or not. I'm going too soon for that, which is weird because that was like one of the easiest ones to me not too long ago. There we go. See, if you for this one, you want to hit the guy in the pink, like the pink one in the center, and then you just want to move it. All right, so the demon's gonna come on over in a second, so I gotta move it. There we go. Roundabout really helped me there. That like totally saved me from getting hit from that guy. I feel like it does sort of change its timing, but it might just be me hyper-focusing on it. Okay, okay. 
man. What is wrong with me? All right, we're going into the second phase while the bubbles are still bouncing though. That is so distracting. That is so not cool. Oh no. I'm gonna get it. I'm not letting this darn evil goat guy get the best of me. Gotten this far already. Okay, that's not bad. Sometimes you can just get lucky with the bubbles and they're the easiest thing to dodge ever. I mean, okay, I wanna call that the easiest thing to dodge ever, but it really wasn't too bad to dodge. I don't have to worry about this demon, yep. Get rid of that guy. Jump, I pressed the jump button. I wonder if it'd be easy with the Xbox controller. I feel like it'd be playing with fire if I wanna change my controller this far into the game. I've been using the PS4 controller this entire time. Why mess with it now? Yeah, this is the last boss as far as I know. Unless there's like a secret final last boss. Oh. Okay. Trying to focus on everything here. Once again, I do want to say I love this guy's animations. Like every boss has been well animated, but I think this guy might be one of my favorites in terms of his animation. When it comes to, like the overall environments, like you know, a good combination of like all of the art aesthetic, including the characters' animations and the environments, I think that goes to the dragon. Still has like the coolest aesthetic combo. All right, well I'm going into this with one HP and no immediate super. He's winking. Can I get it? No. It, it always explodes a bit sooner than I'm thinking it's going to. And I feel like, like I wanna hit it because I wanna get that parry, but maybe it just simply isn't worth going out of the way for. I mean, I feel like I'm starting to get that feeling with all of the parries. It's just simply not worth risking the damage. I mean, if it's there, if it's a situation I can get, go for it, but beyond that, hold back. Just focus on dodging, because what's more important than landing that super is not getting a hit landed on myself. I, okay, that's a fatter spider than I thought it was gonna be. Okay. Last boss or not, I, I, have, I have had a really good time with this game. I do like this boss better than the King Dice so far. He's tough, but King Dice was one of those, like, I think King Dice so far, in my opinion, has been one of the only few truly frustrating bosses in this game. Like, there are some top bosses, don't get me wrong. But I thought there's a, diff like a difference between frustrating difficult and just purely difficult. I think King Dice sort of went too far in one direction. But this guy is fun to unravel. He definitely has some tough sections I'm figuring out, but I'm slowly making progress with each death, or overall, in general. I mean, some, 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 uh, some tries have been better than others, but I'm going into this with two HP. Go on in, and we're good. So dodge to bomb. Like, I, it's gonna explode on the right side. If it comes out of his right ear, it explodes on the right side, and vice versa. So the platformers can get in the way of the shots here. And like, I could just try to, oh boy. Yep, that's, that's unfortunate. You know what, hit you with the super. Should have done this sooner. Should have done that one. I noticed that the, the chip was falling. I should have hit him with the super. Okay, he's mad. All right, the axe isn't gonna hit me here. Oh, but that will. Man, does that just fall quick. You just have to be ready for it. Like, how are you even supposed to know? All right, starting with the dragon ain't too bad of a deal. Hide right over here. Yep. I don't like if you started with the dragon more often, to be honest. That was awful timing. Okay, hold on, the cat opened the door. <laughs> can't play Cuphead if you're opening the door. I'm gonna wake everyone up. Oh gosh, did I not pause the game? Oh well. <laughs> No, I guess I, 
I don't know what happened. Retry. Silly cat. You're trying to make this harder than it already is. Oh, got it. Oh. Okay, just focus on dodging for a little bit. Oh, come on, I dodged the wrong way. I am so bad at this game. The game is irredeemably awful. What is he gonna do now? He's gonna go ahead and do this. I really wish he wouldn't, but he does. I just really don't know what, uh, I'll keep going. I don't know what position I should be in when he starts doing that. He just moves so quick. I right, got that so I can turn around and start hitting him. The door wasn't like 100% closed, so I guess she just sort of pulled it open. <laughs> if you're confused on how she opened the door. Whoa. There we go. I got the super, which is great. He's heading into phase two, which I would prefer if you did when the fireballs disappeared, sir. Okay, so when things get nasty, when I'm about to get hit, activate the super. That's the goal right now. Okay. So far, so good, actually. Okay, hit it. I hit it. Okay, you know what, game? I'm sick of your malarkey. Oh, oh, he's angry now. He's looking all over. I mean, he doesn't even really look at you. Oh, yeah, just, geez. Does the chip always land in the center every single time and I've just not noticed that? It was, it was Shawnee that opened the door. She probably wants to hop out because Shawnee has the awful habit of leaving the room and then five minutes from now, realizing that she actually wanted to be in here anyways and just sits at the door and cries. Like, she leaves for literally no reason. She just gets bored. That's gonna be a hit. The hitbox is on the pupil. Okay, I've just sort of been hitting him in the center of the head and just hoping that it would work, but if it's the pupil itself, I'll keep that in mind. That does give me a, a couple different ideas on where maybe I can be. All right. I just need to listen to the sound cue for that a little bit more. This game's really big on sound cues. Let's try not to take too much damage here, or any. Preferably no damage taken, sir. Thank you. All right, he's becoming a dragon. He's coming in from the left side, which is great because a demon is coming in from the, the other side. Uh, he was coming in from the right, not the left. All right, so he's going to the second phase. We have full health. Sometimes I prefer the bubbles more than I like the flames, but at the same time, I don't really know. So once again, start shooting. When things get nasty, that's when I'll activate the super. But yeah, it definitely is the pupil. You were right about that. Okay, okay, come on, come on, we got it. So it doesn't seem like the poker chip that falls, it never lands in the same area twice. So that's a good thing to keep in mind. Okay, so this guy, gonna do that. That was good. I didn't even have to use my super now, which means I can't move over here. That was total luck. Let's see, yeah, the poker chip doesn't seem to land in the same place twice. Hit him with this. Hit him with this. I am being unnecessary right now. The damage that I'm taking. Oh, that was lucky. That was less lucky that one platform was lower than the other. All right, he's taken out now. This guy's fallen. He's, he's going into cry mode. That is so weird to me. Because the tears don't even match up. Like I hit the tier there, and I wasn't gonna be able to. Hmm. Anyone who opposes me will be destroyed as I cry like a baby. Maybe this is like the last. Maybe there won't be anything like surprise after this. I just, I'd be surprised. Like I feel like it's tough, but it's not that tough, you know? You know how long have we been on the boss for right now? I think about like a half an hour. That's to be expected, at least that. The first phase is just sort of a luck of the draw when it comes to the bubbles, or the fire, or whatever I end up getting. Even though the fire seems to have at least some kind of pattern to it, it goes towards wherever your player is, which is more dodgeable than the bubbles, which just fly into random directions. Okay, so he's gonna be coming in from the left. 
Go back to hitting him. Wow, that was really lucky. I can't believe I actually didn't not get hit there. <laughs> All right, he's, wow. And once again with that, I mean, the bubbles always start in the same spot. So I guess that was all my fault. It's just easier to understand when it isn't, you know? Just sort of blame it on something else that isn't me. But hey, I'm never gonna win with that attitude, now am I? All right, move it. Move it. Okay. And we're good. He has to be low. I think we're just about the end. If we don't hit any parries, it seems like we we get his first phase taken out right before we get our full super. So that's a good way to keep in mind. Okay, start shooting like that. That axe is gonna start flying around. Oh my. I really don't like the flying axe, but it's not really my position to complain. It's just my position to deal with it. All right, hit him with the super now. And I just feel like it's a good time to. There we go. He's straight sneezing. I mean, I guess this is definitely where I can see the spread shot working out. You're right about that. Oh my, no, I ended up dodging one damage and just getting hit by the other. That was awful. You're still in the Sugarland boss. It's a tough boss. It's, it's, every boss in this game is not easy. But this is just one of the even less easier ones. Let me go ahead and change that then. I'm not using the charge. I might as well try something different. I can see how the, uh, the spread could help. Especially since I am definitely, now that I'm looking at it, missing some shots. Don't need to get more tea, but I'm just too invested. I need to win this. That sort of lands, but it doesn't land the most of it. So it's, I really think it's like here, that's where it's a good use to you. So there's some sprinklings of the spread shot that can really be helpful here. Can you do your goat phase next? You can, perfect. All right, so he's doing his incantation. It is the bubble bouncings of doom. I mean, you'd think he'd have something a bit more sinister. Like, if you were like, just the definition of evil. <laughs> oh, you know what I would do? I, I'll, I'll shoot bubbles at him. <laughs> That's the evilest thing I could think of. And then after that, I'm going to put a, a poor grade on his report card. He'll get grounded for weeks. All right, uh. Well, that was silly of me. I was <laughs> trying to catch up with everything. I'm using a controller, yes. I'm using the PS4 controller, specifically. Okay. For whatever reason, like, I'm holding down the shoot button before that phase starts, and then, like, it stops, so you have to repress it. I'm not used to that. You're always close range with this ball, so spreads can be very useful, yeah. Especially for, like, once you go down under, that's definitely where it gets even closer. For this, I don't like it just because like it seems like it does miss some, but I'll try it all the way this time. Maybe that'll make the big difference. I also like the, the you know, round shot for this, the roundabout or whatever, just because it does give me like an extra chance of hitting him, even if I miss him, like if I slightly miss him like that, it still can go back up and hit him. Uh, let's try this again. Yeah, this is a very crowded boss fight. Maybe we can help him get this out of his system right away and not take any damage. If I could just get through this phase without taking any damage like I had before. It just, it, there's a lot of luck involved, depending on what you get. This part's not too bad to dodge. It's just this one's definitely the rarest out of the three and that's why I still get hit with it. It's Even the easiest ones are tough to dodge. There you go, it's not bad right there. Ow! I like the, the noise they make when they die. Like, ow, okay, ow. Oh, that's unnecessary. <laughs> yeah, the chaser helped me a lot out with the, uh, the candy boss as well. I really like the chaser. It seems like a lot of people are against it, but honestly, it's helping with most of the boss fights. I really should just not do it the way I'm doing it. That's silly of me.
Okay, move over here. I've gotten a little bit better at dodging this guy. I don't remember the last time I've taken damage from him, but it'll probably be right now since I'm saying it. Okay. Oh, that was almost too soon. Gotta be real careful with that. All right, it's the bubbles. Move to the left, move to the right, move to the right, move to the left, move to the left, move to the right, look up. Okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good indeed. All right, he's coming into the, okay, I got it. Oh, I cannot believe I just ran into his big old face. Come on, get rid of this dude. Uh, uh. I'm done with you. I am done with you. And you're being very difficultness. <sighs> All right. I can't believe I got hit by that too. Embarrassing things happening right now. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, indeed. It's really tough. And this one, I'm hoping there's not a secret extra phase. Because this is, this is plenty for me. Jump that, dodge it, easy enough. Seems like jumping here gets an extra couple hits in, which is good. Never really thought about that. Demon's about to come in from the, okay, we got him right away. Whoa. There's just no need to get the parries here. We do enough damage to like not even have to worry about it. Oh. All right, mister. There we go, okay, that was full HP. That's good. Had a moment of silence just to focus on it. But I do not have full, uh, as soon as I say that, I don't have the full uh, super, but that's fine. I don't need the full super right away because we're about to get it. And then I can just be here and, and then get hit so unnecessarily, it would drive anybody mad. All right. And a bomb's gonna pop out of your ear, which is great to know. Wow, that hit me. I mean, I guess I get it, but come on. Man, I actually did this without taking any damage and then I lose all of my health. The silliest way possible, because I need at least more than one HP for that final little phase. I really, really do. All right, so I probably should get over here, but that is so tough. Oh, that is so tough. I got pretty far there, though. That's just, this is my goal right now. My small goal, my, my major goal is to beat the boss. My small goal is to get to the final phase where he's crying like a baby with at least two health. Okay. All right, dodge over here. Oh, that was a close one. Equally as close. Please disappear, Bubbles, you did, thank you. That was good. Oh, man. Oh! Hit me with your best shot, Mr. Spider. Okay, that wasn't bad. I feel like he, he pounced down less times than normal then. Okay, phase one done. This is becoming a more regular occurrence, which is great. This boss is easier than King Dice. I sort of agree so far. I mean, I spent two hours on King Dice. I better agree. I mean, who knows? Maybe I'll spend two hours on this guy, especially if I keep on making dingus moves like that. Have some milk. A little bit. That one wasn't too bad to dodge. I mean, I probably should be using the spread shot, but it's just, there's so much going on, it's hard to remember to change my weapons, especially when I press the wrong button. Why? Why must I be this way? That hit me. <laughs> the problem is that you don't have invincible frames after you were done with the long animation. Sometimes it's better to use the EX attack. Yeah, I'm starting to feel that way too. Yeah, I see what you mean. It's just how much more damage is the super compared to just five or four, I guess, EX attacks. That's always what I'm worried about because I guess I don't have any like solid numbers to work off of. So it's all just guessing for me. It's like, while I would like to use the normal EX attacks, I'm always worried they're not gonna do any damage that makes it worthwhile. But I'll try that on. 
I appreciate the suggestion. I mean, I'm not really used to the EX attacks for the roundabout and the uh, the spread shot, but I'll try them, you know? Might be an interesting experience. Well, I've taken damage. As long as I don't, don't, don't take any more, right? Oh, I gotta move this way. Ooh, not bad, not bad. Got him, got him, that wasn't bad. Gonna try to more heavily use the spread shot this time. Uh, two HP isn't bad, as long as I just don't take any more damage, I'm fine. I like also how his, like he obviously hops out of his skin like a suit, but even the trident gets all wiggly. I sort of like that. Okay, so that's gonna start circling around. And I'm gonna hit this. I only did it because I was trying to avoid that damage, to be totally honest. I mean, I've dodged this, like I know the first time I got here, I dodged everything like a champ. Now, not so much, come on. Oh man, I almost made a horrible, horrible mistake. I'm gonna switch back to the roundabout just for this part. Already got him through that phase, that's great. So let's try this out. Oh, oh my. Okay, that was a little crazy. Whoa, okay, that's not so crazy. Wow, that really works weird. I've never seen that. Let's try that one more time. I don't know if that landed at all. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, well, hey, I think we just got him. Yeah, he's crying. I gotta get rid of these guys, but the, the waterworks are happening. I mean, I think of what, you can get hit by the tears, okay. Oof, oof and a half. <laughs> That's a major oof right there. But if I could just avoid getting hit by the tears, I really don't even need to land on the tears. I'm trying to jump around them, because if I just jump and then dodge, it's fine. You know, at least that's how I see it. Those guys aren't bad to dodge, but then I mess up the easy part. So much oof. Move it, move it. Hold on, whoa! Once again, just don't take any more damage, I'll be fine. I'm totally taking damage. Damage happening. Any moment. Any moment. Any moment. Uh, uh. <laughs> Holy cow. Did you hear an oof? You heard multiple. Oh, man. Start shooting. I'll try this out. Oh, my. Oh, my. Hey, hey Dodging King. There we go, there we go. So I, I threw an EX and I have a super? That sounds good to me. I don't know when I'm gonna use it. Maybe in a moment. I just really appreciate the EX because it does give me a second to dodge. The problem is very much so that you can just end up getting hit afterwards anyways, but if I could just survive and then just hit you like that. That's the phase where you're supposed to be calling in your friends, but I've already gotten through it. Mostly. Oh wow, I cannot believe I didn't get hit there and I got hit there. I really don't like the hitbox for the chip. I feel like it's weird. What happens if you give him the contracts? I think somebody was saying that it restarts the game. So that's definitely not something I want to do. I really have no clue. Maybe like that's how you activate hard mode. Cause somebody was also saying you can get extrovert mode in this game. So I have no idea what happens when you give him the contracts, but I, I'll find out later, maybe. <laughs> We've been playing Cuphead for almost three hours today. I still can't beat this dude. I get over with that. Nice. Oh no! <laughs> Why? That's so easy. I shouldn't be messing it up. I think I just need to get like a snack. I think we need a midstream snack or something. I think that's what I'm hankering for. I definitely think that's what I'm hankering for. I know I can do it. I was thinking multiple endings. Possibly? I really don't know. We'll find out later probably. I figure I can just have that option again once I beat the dude. Oh! What is to eat then? I have no clue. Probably not anything crazy. Because if I eat anything too crazy, I'll end up burping. 
a bunch, and nobody likes somebody who burps a lot on stream, right? Okay. Into spider mode right now. I think that he's done this phase after spider mode, so as long as I don't take any silly damage, I really shouldn't. It's spider mode, you know? There we go. I know he's low. On, I know he's low. He's got another one of these up his sleeve, really? Oh, I probably shouldn't have parried that. That got uncomfortably close, okay. No, come on, how am I supposed to dodge 18 things at once? It's not 18. Man. Oh, that is a pain in the booty and a half. Are you gonna wink at me, buddy? I'm gonna take it out. Get rid of your wink. That's some good damage right there. That's the kind of damage I want to see more in my life. So, so far I haven't taken any damage from him. That was decent. That was sort of decent. I'm not getting that. <laughs> I let go of the dream. And I'm back down to one sinking HP. If, man, my life would be so great if I could just do this, get to that final area without taking, or at least, you know, at least, Having, no, oh, no, 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 yeah. He's crying, I'm crying. This is a bunch of waterworks everywhere. Get out of here, you monster. Yeah, we did it. Yeah. He's, well, what is he doing? He's just scratching his head. Is that it? Did we do it? Oh, oh man. My concept of reality is destroyed. We got the two great skill level. I don't know how you could only get one star. We haven't gotten a one star skill level, I don't think ever. A minus. <laughs> the brothers had triumph over the, the, the demon, forcing him to finally give up. We shall accept your surrender, devil. Oh, that wasn't the devil speaking. Cuphead laughed, but we're not done just yet. And with that, Cuphead and Mugman destroyed all of the soul contracts, releasing Inkle Isles for ever residence from Eternal servitude to the devil. Gosh, I can't wait to tell everybody, Cuphead said. The boys slid off to home, uh, for home, and at top speed, come on, last one, there's a leaky cup, Mugman teased as they ran. Once home, the brothers gathered everyone together. You're all free from the devil's debt, Cuphead announced, and that fiend won't bother us again, Mugman added. The Elder Kettle was literally brimming with pride as everyone began to cheer. Let's hear it for Cuphead and Mugman! Hip hip hurrah! Hip hip hurrah! Wow we As an all day celebration began, the brothers promised to never wander into trouble again, and they didn't, until the next time, of course. But that is another story. Cuphead 2, maybe? I don't know. The end. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh, oh man, we beat him! So it was just a three hour long session to do it, but we did it. Our sincere appreciation to the members of our team whose loyalty and creative endeavor made this made possible this production. Aw, that's great. Oh man, I thought the good ending was defeating him and the bad ending was just giving him the contracts. I have no clue, like I said, I don't know. Maybe we can find that on afterwards, but wow, what a game! I can see how that was a lot of people's game of the year. It was really, really gosh darn fun. There were some crazy battles in that, but like I said, it was like a lot of other very well designed difficult games in the way that a lot of them weren't too frustrating. They were certainly challenging and you know, that was you know a source of like, ooh, I, w I, I gotta be doing better. But it was never like, oh, the game's cheating me. Except for King Dice's boss fight. King, Dice's, King, King Dice's boss fight was not that great in my opinion for a couple of reasons. The bosses themselves not bad. The, the random activity, that was a fun idea, but the foreground problems they kept throwing in there, like that's not a gimmick, that's just, I don't know, weird design. Everything else though, I can't think of a boss I really, really disliked beyond King Dice. <sighs> One star skill level is is for simple, so it's not possible for King Dice or Devil. Okay, that's what I thought. We didn't do any of them on simple, so we're good. We did it all in regular difficulty. So apparently there's a crazy difficulty. I am definitely not playing that. <laughs> I can say that for sure. I am definitely not playing it. I love this credit sequence though, this is fun. 
I didn't think there were so many people involved with this. I thought it was sort of a little closer knit, but I mean, a lot of it seems to be a, a lot about the music production, which is interesting because the music production was insane in this game. Like everything, top notch when it comes to the production of the game, the visuals, you know, the music, the, everything was really cool. For being an indie game, it's really blowing, blowing me away. But yeah, a lot of this is actually, a lot of it is uh, music credits. Am I gonna end the stream? No, I'm not gonna end the stream because I might play a little bit of Fortnite because people have been asking me to. Especially since tomorrow's Wednesday, so I won't be going live. Or, yeah, technically it's Wednesday as of five minutes ago. But tomorrow's the Wednesday day. I won't be streaming on Wednesday. It's the only day of the week I do not stream. So I wanted to you know, try to stream as much as I can right now. I might take a little bit of a break to grab a snack, but then I'll try some solo Fortnite since people have been asking me to do that. I get the new computer tomorrow. FedEx confirmed it for me. So I'm getting the new computer tomorrow. As long as I'm home or somebody's home to accept the package, I'll have a new computer to be streaming from and improve the quality of the stream starting on Thursday. You join just as soon as it finishes. Well, like I said, I will be moving on to uh, some, what's it called, some solo Fortnite. Can I play ARMS? I do wanna play ARMS, but I, because of how my current computer works, the days that I'm doing PC games, I can't do console games because I'd have to end the stream and change a bunch of settings and then restart it up. And people hate it when I do that, they'll just leave the stream. So I won't be doing ARMS today, but at some point I do want to stream ARMS, yeah. Okay, well, that was good. Your computer hype. <laughs> I'm hyped for it. I have no clue what's going on here with this super long credits, but it does take a while. Is there a way to speed it up? I don't think so. Really good game though. I'll give it that much. That was a really gosh darn good game. I know some people have been like, hey, can you play other super difficult games? Uh, some people want to play, want me to play Loving Memory of da Jason. Oh, poor Jason. Oh, this was a Unity game? I'm, I'm blown away by that. Um, But, what was I saying? A lot of people want me to play Getting Over It. I don't know if anyone still wants to see me play Getting Over It, but maybe we can play some Getting Over It sometime in the next week or so. This stream doesn't seem that bad. Thank you, I appreciate it. I have a better mic, but currently my current PC doesn't have a sound card. So when you, like, the mic has like this clicking noise in the background of it, it's my computer not being able to handle the sound. Uh, new computer has a sound card, so it should be able to handle that. But people watching on YouTube, the YouTube upload of this, thank you for supporting the series. The series has been doing very well on YouTube. I hope you've enjoyed it. We'll be doing more stream playthroughs soon, so if you haven't followed on Twitch, be sure to do that. But yeah. <laughs>